Hi there, welcome back to another video and today I'm going to show you this popular snacks in Cambodia and it's called caramelized sweet potatoes. Yeah, it's really easy and it's delicious as well. Make yourself at home. The thing that you need to make it happen is 600 grams of sweet potatoes, coconut flesh, but it's optional. You don't really need to put coconut flesh in it if you can't find it in your area. Use something as a substitute that's so similar to coconut flesh, but if you do have coconut flesh, make sure that the layers of coconut flesh is really thin. And then you need two tablespoons of coconut cream, a bowl of coconut water or coconut juice, and this is optional, you don't need it. A tablespoon of palm sugar, traditional Cambodian palm sugar. You can use white sugars instead of palm sugars. One tablespoon of roasted sesame seeds, but it's optional, you don't need this. And here's the list of all of the ingredients that you need to make this happen. As I mentioned that this is just the guidance and if you want your caramelized sweet potato to taste more sweet you should always put more sugars because I really don't like it to be so sweet so that's why I only use one tablespoon of palm sugar use two or three depends on the levels of sweetness that you really like let's just peel off the sweet potato skin Then you can cow it like you can see here, but uh, it's optional Once again, you don't have to do that. Then cut your sweet potato in small pieces like this, soak them in water. Then don't forget to add one teaspoon of salt in it and give it there for at least 30 minutes. Then we can start cooking by uh, one tablespoon of palm sugars on a hot pan. You can use white sugars, it's fine. Stir it for a bit and add one bowl of coconut juice and you can add water instead of coconut juice. And don't forget to add one bit of sauce in it. Then give it to oil and after that put your sweet potato in and stir it a little bit and wait until it's boiling and see if it's soft enough to your liking and if it's not, just keep it there for more and after that just put two tablespoons of coconut cream in and mix it well together with your sweet potatoes and keep it there until you can see there's no water left or until the sweet potatoes are soaked enough to your liking and you can see here then put the coconut flesh into it stir it well and then sprinkle a little bit of sesame seeds just keep some for the last part of it and mix it well together like you can see in this video and that's it, you can eat it now. Just sprinkle the little bits of sesame seeds on top of it and also put some coconut flesh on top and you're good to go. I hope you like this recipe and if you make one at home, please tag me on Instagram. See you around, thank you.